My name is Mehmet Gürses. I am an assistant professor of political science at Florida Atlantic University. I am a native of Turkey and I got my PhD from University of North Texas. I am an expert on ethnic and religious conflicts, post-Civil War democracy and peace building. I am fluent in Turkish and Kurdish languages and I have spent the last three summers in Turkey and Iraq conducting research on the rise of Islamist parties and the Kurdish conflict in the Middle East. When you look at the history of the Middle East, you see the collapse of the multilingual, multi-ethnic and multi-religious Ottoman Empire in the early 20th century. As a result of this, the rise of modern nation states in the Middle East, they have been trying to forge national identities. As a part of these policies, they have repressed ethnic as well as religious minorities in the last decades. As a result, um, to give an example, in the early 20th century, nearly 20% of the population in Turkey was Christian. As of today, this number is less than 1%. To be more specific, in 1920s, the Christian community in Istanbul, the largest city in Turkey, which used to be the capital of the Ottoman Empire for centuries, was almost 300,000. As of today, this number is less than 3,000 only. So when you look at the rise of these nation states and also the changes that the Middle East and North Africa has been going through in the last year or so, uh, it raises an important question about the prospects and the status of religious and ethnic minorities in these Muslim majority societies. Egypt, Syria, Lebanon, Iraq and many other Muslim majority countries have significant religious and ethnic minorities. So the question is, as these countries are going through democratization, as these countries are becoming electoral democracies, what will be the status and the rights of these minorities in these societies? The more important question is, are we about to replace one type of authoritarianism with another type? So in this lecture series, I will be talking about the the history of the minorities in the Middle East and the status of Christians, Jews, Armenians, as well as other minorities in Turkey, Iraq, Syria, and many other countries. This will be primarily what we will be talking about. Thank you.